Clad in their military uniforms, projecting discipline and respect, officers saluted their new leader, General Akin Tong Aleo, with high expectations of improved services and decisive leadership despite the challenges inherent in the role. The event marked by POM and military displays of rank and precision So, Lieutenant General Luis Natali Fingi, Deputy Director for Administration and Finance and the Internal Security Bureau offers his congratulations to both the outgoing and incoming directors. He pledges cooperation ensuring the Bureau successfully fulfills its constitutional duty of protecting the nation with integrity and professionalism. I call upon all the Chiefs of Division Directors of his turn alone directorate, directors of specialized departments and units to divulge the same spirit of cooperation and assistance according to our predecessor that tolerate and mark this tenor as success. Also to our incoming director general so that his tenor is equally to mark the Director General of the General Intelligence Bureau, General Simon Yen Makwach, encourages Aleo to face the challenges ahead with determination and professionalism. To restrict on our mandate enshrined in the National Security Service Act and desist from politics. Two, respect our leaderships and let us misuse the authority busted upon us. Echoing President Salva Kiir Mayandi's call for officers to rise above praises and criticism in the line of duty, General Aleo vowed to work closely with his predecessor, acknowledging his pivotal role in laying an indelible foundation and strengthening national security. Aleo also stresses his commitment to not allowing personal relationships to interfere with his duties, pledging to meet the expectations set by President Salva Kiir Mayandi. I carry with me the lesson learned from years of services and the example set by those before me. I have witnessed first only the incredible detection and professionalism exhibited by each member of this institution. In his address, Aleo drew is a vision for the Internal Security Bureau, including enhancing intelligence gathering, providing informed advice to the highest authorities, eradicating corruption, and deepening both regional and international cooperation. We will also prioritize strengthening our relationship with our domestic and international partners, intelligent and not operate in a vehicle. The threat we face are global in nature. And Pomi Road in Central will be strengthening for the success. Truth. We can share vital information enhancing our strategic account available and ensure that our response are timely and effective. The multi practice of corruption that are taking place in this country will stop today. As outlined in Articles 159 and 160 of the Guiding Principles of the National Security Service, the Bureau is constitutionally required to remain subordinate to civilian authority respect the will of the people, uphold the rule of law, protect human rights, promote democracy and gathering, 
analyzing and providing vital information to relevant authorities of the country. General Ken Tong Aleo takes over from General Paul Cole, which a leading role of the national security amid a heightened internal and external pressures. The nation is grappling with armed robberies, road ambushes and encroachment by neighboring communities. Now his colleagues in the military are really calling on him to strengthen the national security for the benefit of South Sudanese in regards of their safety and also the nation. Reporting for SSBC News, Matthias Joseph, Dubai.